Well, a string trimmer is a handy tool to have for a gardener, uh, but eventually that string is going to run out. And for you do-it-yourselfers at home, being able to repair your own equipment will save you money. And so today we're going to show you how to restring that weed whacker. So the first thing we have to do when we run out of string is remove the, the spool. This particular spool has two channels to wind the string into. Each of these strings will be fed out onto each side of the, the weed trimmer. So I have two pieces of equal length string. I'll start with one. And it is important to check the owner's manual of your particular weed trimmer to make sure that you wind the string in the right direction. Once you have your string wound into the spool, the next step is to feed the line through the head on your string trimmer. You can trim off the excess line from the ends, replace the cap, and you're ready to fire this thing up. This is Chris Hilgert with the University of Wyoming Extension, and you're watching From the Ground Up.